Eh, sabi nga natin, di ba, Olof, or optimum level of functioning, aka high level of wellness. And ang focus natin, we have two focus sa CHN. The first one, the first one is health promotion. Health promotion. Ano ba tong health promotion nito? Di ba, alam na natin to, parang since, ano pa, funda pa, di ba? Health promotion, ilang beses na yun na mention. So basically, health promotion, health promotion is to increase the level of health. Okay? Increase the level of health. From a healthy person, from a healthy client, we have to help them to become a healthier client. Okay? We have to help them to become a healthier client or a healthier patient. Ayan. Healthy from becoming healthy to becoming healthier. Yan ang purpose ng ating health promotion. We have to increase their level of health by making them healthy from healthy to healthy your ganon ganon and paano natin magagawa usually usually we have this mnemonic d e r s d e r s to promote health to our patient to promote health we are patient first is balance diet okay balance diet balance diet and a good parameter na balance ang diet na ating patient is to aim for ideal body weight and ang ideal body weight natin Ideal body weight natin with WHO, WHO, ano nga? Through BMI, di ba? It is measured through body mass index. And ang body mass index natin sa WHO, tandaan yan, tandaan yan. 18 to 25. Pero, pero kapag Asia Pacific Obesity Guidelines, ang tinatanong, we have, since mas payat ang Asians eh, mas ano, lesser yung build pa, and not lesser yung build, pero mas lighter mas lighter ang build ng Asians. Kaya medyo may adjustments when it comes to Asians and we have our own guidelines and tinatawag kapag tatanungin sa boards, ano daw, ano daw ang ideal body weight based sa APOG or Asia Pacific, Asia Pacific Obesity Guidelines should be 18, 18 to 23. Tandaan nyo yan. 18 to 23 na BMI. Okay? 18 to 23 na BMI. Now, the E. The E for our health promotion is exercise. Okay? Exercise, and it should be regular. Regular exercise. Regular exercise. And regular exercise natin. Anong parameter natin na ang patients natin, na ang patients natin sa community, malalaman natin na nagkaroon ng regular exercise. Okay? Regular Exercise. According to WHO, ang regular exercise, tandaan nyo to, is cumulative more than 150 minutes per week. Okay? More than 150 minutes per week of moderate intensity exercises. Okay? More than 150 per minutes of moderate intensity exercises. Yan ang parameter natin for for ating exercise. Okay? Exercise. The next sa ating health promotion, next sa ating health promotion, di ba, may dina. Di ba? May dina, may ina. May ina. And then meron din tayong R. Okay? Ang R is rest and sleep. Okay? Rest. Of course, kailangan mo ng rest. Mabuting rest. And 8 hours of sleep per night, di ba? Sa adult, 6 to 8 hours of sleep per night. Kailangan mo rin ng rest. Okay? Kailangan mo ng rest to become healthy. And lastly, we have to stop smoking. Okay? We have to stop smoking, okay? Smoking. And according to WHO, we can't stop smoking. There are two. There are two approaches to stop smoking. First is legislation, and next is patient education. Tandaan nyo yan. Through legislation, it's in my notes, okay? Through legislation and through patient education. Okay, through legislation tayo. Ano yung law? Ano yung law? For stopping smoking. Ano yung law? First law to regulate smoking in the Philippines. To regulate tobacco smoking in the Philippines. That law, tandaan nyo to, is RA-9211. Okay, RA-9211. Isipin nyo lang. Isipin nyo lang yan mga mi. Isipin nyo lang yan. Isipin nyo lang yan. Dalawang stick ng cigarette. Dalawang stick ng cigarette. Ayan. C11, di ba? Dalawang stick ng cigarette. Stop Smoking. Nine. Paano mnemonic natin pag nine? Paano na mnemonic natin pag nine? Hindi ko alam. Hindi ko, hindi ko din alam. Basta ayun. Basta ayun. Basta ayun. Nine, two, one, one. Again, anong law natin? Anong law natin? Start ng law for regulating smoking in the Philippines. RA, dalawang stick. Tandaan nyo yan. Dalawang stick ng cigarette. 
dalawang stick, dalawang stick ng cigarette, dalawang stick ng cigarette. Okay? 9211. And anong provisions? Important provisions ng ating 9211. Anong important provisions ng ating 9211? Basically, this is the Tobacco Regulation Act. And first is no smoking in public areas. Okay? No smoking in public areas. Second, second important provision niya is no selling of smoke within 100 meters of school. Okay? 100 meters of school premises. No selling of smoke within 100 meters of school premises. And lastly, is reduce advertising or no advertising or no advertisements. Okay? No advertisements. Okay? No advertisements for smoke. Okay? For smoke. Okay? Ayan. Ayan important provisions ng ating 9211. 9211. 9211. 9211. Ulitin natin. Stop Smoking Tobacco Regulation Act. Tobacco Regulation Act. Anong Tobacco Regulation Act? Tobacco Regulation Act. Mami. Mami. Hello? Andiyan pa ba kayo? Andiyan pa ba kayo? Andiyan pa ba kayo? 